I want y'all to guess who just got accused of cultural appropriation. Comment now. You commented? Did y'all guess Daniel Cohen? Well, you were right. Hey loves, your girl is back as usual with an extra hot and juicy recap for you guys. And y'all, Olivia Ponton is really out here getting exposed for being a cheater by an old classmate. What is it with old classmates exposing? Girl. In today's recap, we're gonna be talking about Danielle Cohen offending the black culture after posting a very controversial picture, a former classmate accusing Olivia Ponton of cheating and being rude, Madison Beer getting dragged for dating the TikToker Nick Austin. The drama is only starting to get worse, y'all. So let's get on with today's video. So you're telling me Danielle Cohen just offended the entire black community for cultural appropriation? Nikita Dragon? Y'all probably know how influencers get called out all the time for cultural appropriation. Now, Danielle Cohn just had to hop on this trend after she decided to post some very offensive Instagram photos that people were not here for. The minute after she posted it, a lot of people started coming for Danielle from all over the place, with many people accusing her for blackfishing as well as having the same hairstyle as people in black culture. Okay, but this is borderline blackfishing, not okay. Oh, still trying to be a race that you're not? If you're gonna do edges, please support black people in our times of need. Ooh. Girl. Danielle is getting the heat. And as y'all can probably imagine, Danielle didn't really take time to address the situation whatsoever. But instead, she kept her picture up after she received tons of backlash from it. Is it really that hard to delete the picture and apologize? The c <laughs> But anyways, what's your opinion of Danielle getting accused of cultural appropriation? Do you think she deserves all the backlash? Let me know your opinion and thoughts in the comments. So, I can't believe I predicted that this was going to be a trend, but a former classmate just exposed Olivia Ponton for being a cheater and a rude person. And let's just say that it got very dirty. As mentioned in my previous videos, a lot of people have come forward lately to expose the real side of some TikTokers before they blew up on TikTok. And well, one of these TikTokers is the one and only Olivia Ponton, who recently got dragged by the TikToker Jenna, who claimed that Olivia Olivia took her boyfriend, knowing for a fact that he was in a relationship. She probably knew he had a girlfriend too. She did. But y'all. After this, even more people started coming forward to expose Olivia's true colors. In fact, another former classmate went on Instagram and claimed that Olivia was very mean towards her in high school. Okay, but was she mean? She acted above everyone. As someone who goes to Gulf Coast, I can confirm that she was in fact not nice. I had acne in high school. Um, okay, olive oil. She did go on Accutane, but her acne genuinely was not even that bad. It was normal little bit of acne. And guys, when you thought things couldn't get any worse, the former classmate then went on and exposed her even more by accusing Olivia of hitting her friend with a car. Wait, <laughs> with a what? Olivia is kinda nice, her acne wasn't that bad, she acted above everyone, she was rude to our coaches sometimes, unfollowed me and a lot of people at our school on IG when she started getting big, she hit my friend with a car while she was walking and pretended like it didn't happen. That's all I have to say about her. Did I read that last part correctly? Yes, my friend was walking through the school parking lot and Olivia was driving her car and slightly hit my friend and avoided eye contact after. Now, after this, everyone started believing the accusations that were made about Olivia, with many attacking and canceling her all over social media. However, her old classmate suddenly decided to delete all her TikTok videos and apologize publicly for making false accusations. I would like to make a formal apology to Olivia Ponton. She did not hit my friend with her car. She did, um, I think maybe accidentally brush her with it. That is all. And maybe she didn't see her. Olivia genuinely is a decent person. And what I said was just because I am stupid and I was bored and kind of just wanted attention on TikTok. Who lied to her and said it was okay to make false accusations on someone? S. M H. But anyways, y'all, what's your opinion on people calling out Olivia for being rude and being a cheater? Let me know in the comments. Um, Madison Beer and Nick Austin are allegedly dating, and let's just say that no one is here for it. If you guys have seen the latest news, a lot of fans are currently freaking out about the fact that Madison and Nick 
could possibly be dating since, well, Nick literally flirted with Madison multiple times on social media by commenting things like, baby, you're hot. But guys, after a couple of days passed without knowing anything on what could have happened between them off camera, the paparazzi came and gave us all the answers after he found Nick at dinner at a restaurant. And y'all, here's what he had to say. What's going on with you and Madison? Oh man, she's gorgeous. Wow, okay, you gonna, you gonna, you gonna uh, take your shot, shoot your shot with her, man? You gonna ask her out? Maybe. 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 And while Nick was trying to avoid all questions just to get into the restaurant, guess who ended up suspiciously being there too? Oh yes, Madison Beer. In fact, this entire time he was going to have dinner with her. And let's just say it wasn't like any other dinner. Shortly after these pictures and videos were leaked by a paparazzi, the whole internet was very confused, with some saying that Madison could find someone much better. Am I the only one that finds this kind of weird? Like, that's Madison Beer and a tick talker. She could have like gotten with a model or an actor. What is this random duo? To be honest, y'all, I feel like no one really expected the two of them together, but it is what it is. Anyways, loves, what's your opinion on Madison Beer and Nick Austin dating? Also, what did you think of today's recap? Let me know in the comments down below. I love you so much.